This is a Coin 6 News breaking news alert. We got a suspect down. And uh, we need call three medical here. Suspect's been shot. Breaking tonight, a suspect dead, shot and killed in a confrontation with police. Investigators say he fired first after robbing a bank at gunpoint in Gresham. Welcome to Coin 6 News at 10 o'clock. I'm Dan Tilkin. Jeff and Liz are off tonight. That shooting came after leading law enforcement on the car chase through Gresham. Elise Haas is live on the scene of this breaking news to explain the chain of events. We're at Gresham Station, the outdoor shopping mall, and that's where the deadly deputy and officer involved shooting ended. You can see where the police tape is. We have multiple units out on scene, and they're focusing their investigation on a couple of vehicles right now. And they have already been out here for hours, but this is just the start of a very lengthy investigation that's going to go into the wee hours of the morning because this involves multiple crimes from armed robberies to a car chase to shootings to even a carjacking that then ended in this deputy and officer involved shooting. Around a quarter till 5 p.m., Gresham police got a call of an armed robbery at Key Bank on Burnside in Gresham. When Multnomah County Sheriff's Office patrol deputies located the suspect's vehicle, the suspect fled and deputies gave chase. This was an extremely chaotic and dangerous incident. It occurred during rush hour commute hours. The suspected robber led police on a chase into Troutdale and then back into Gresham. While he was driving, the suspect fired a number of times at the responding officers. The officer saw a white man and a woman in the passenger seat get out of their getaway car and carjack another driver. That's when a Multnomah County Sheriff's deputy and Gresham police officer both fired their guns, killing the suspected robber at the scene. They took the woman into custody. We believe this person was involved in uh, robberies in the Portland metro area. The East Multnomah County Major Crimes Team is now conducting the multifaceted investigation. The deputy and the officer who shot and killed the suspected robber are placed on leave during this investigation. And, you know, this is pretty remarkable that at least no one else got hurt during this, considering it happened from the bank to weaving in and out of traffic to happening here at the shopping mall. But because it was happening all during rush hour, there were a lot of witnesses to this deadly shooting and this car chase and the bank robbery. So if you are a witness, then the sheriff is asking you to call their investigators and let them know what you saw. Live in Gresham, Elise Haas, Quinn 6 News.